You're listening to the Amazing Facts Daily Devotional. Today's topic, Sojourner Truth Lifting Up Freedom. Isabella Bomfrey was born into slavery in New York in 1797. As she grew up, she was sold several times and eventually married another slave named Thomas, with whom she had five children. In 1827, New York freed all slaves, but Isabella had already left her husband and ran away with her youngest child, Sophia. She later learned that one of her children, Peter, had been sold into slavery in Alabama. Because Peter had been emancipated under New York law, she sued in court and won his return. She was the first black woman to win such a case against a white man. Isabella eventually lived with Isaac and Maria Van Wagenen, where she had a life-changing religious experience and became a devout Christian. The year 1843 was a turning point for Isabella when she became convicted that God was calling her to be a traveling preacher. She told friends, The Spirit calls me, and I must go. Thus, she changed her name to Sojourner Truth. Sojourner became an advocate for women's rights, temperance, and the abolition of slavery. She was a speaker and went on lecture tours, delivering messages that demanded equal rights for women and blacks. For 10 years, True spoke before hundreds of audiences. She was also privileged to meet Harriet Beecher Stowe and, during the Civil War, President Abraham Lincoln. For a period of time, she was friendly with the Millerite movement that preached the soon coming of Jesus, but later left the group. In 1857, She moved to Battle Creek, Michigan, and, according to some reports, became a Sabbath-keeping Christian. She died in 1883 and was buried in Oak Hill Cemetery in Battle Creek, in the same graveyard as other Sabbath-keeping pioneers, including Ellen G. White. Though she was once sold at the age of nine for a hundred dollars along with a flock of sheep, this brave woman found Christ and became a spokesperson for the belief that all people are created equal. She once said, Truth is powerful, and it prevails. Have you ever stood up and spoken out against an injustice you observed? God wants us to stand for truth, especially in these last days. Our key Bible text today comes from Psalm chapter 146 and verses 6 to 7, which made heaven and earth, the sea, and all that therein is, which keepeth truth forever, which executeth judgment for the oppressed, which giveth food to the hungry, the Lord looseth the prisoners. Thank you for listening to the Amazing Facts Daily Devotional.